European Union defence ministers will take stock of the EU mission in Mali, where hundreds of troops are helping to train the military. At their meeting in Luxembourg, the ministers will be briefed by the mission's commander, General Francois Le Quint, some three weeks after training began to help rebuild the poorly armed and ill-equipped force. The 550-strong EU contingent is training four battalions, almost 2,500 soldiers, in 10-week blocks. Apart from combat and logistics, the troops will also learn about democracy and the rule of law. Mali has been racked by military coups and an insurgency. One of the EU's chief aims is to bring the army back under full civilian control and restore its image in the eyes of a sceptical public. The EU mission has a 15-month mandate and a common budget of 12.3 million euros. The ministers will discuss whether to provide the army with more equipment and the transition of the African-led operation in rest of northern Mali to United Nations control. Also on the agenda is the EU's defence industry and its rapid reaction battle groups, as ministers prepare for a summit of European leaders in December, which will focus in part on defence. The battle groups are a multinational force designed to be quickly dispatched to crisis areas and operate for at least 30 days. Nations commit to providing troops and equipment on a rotating six-month basis, and two battle groups have been on standby since 2007. The battle groups have never been deployed and contributors are becoming difficult to find.